Hi everybody, it's been a while since I've done a video, but um, I'm usually just updating my blog now, so I hardly ever do videos, but um, you guys can go to my blog and check it out. I'll put my blog in my um, thingy. Anyways, um, this is just something I threw together starting last night, Sunday night. I just had one of those um, Michael's Round wooden boxes. And I started painting it, well I, I painted it, for the most part, um, inside and out black. Um, and I just had it up on my shelf for like a month or so. And I just didn't really know what I wanted to do with it. And then um, I got an idea of what I wanted to do with it. And I wanted to use this once upon a time paper, but I couldn't line up the paper well enough to get it all to fit. And I, thought of just using the flowers and then how do I get the fairies on there blah 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 and then I thought well, I'll just use this paper because I don't really want it in my bag because I'm going to be taking this with me and have you guessed what I'm using it for yet anyways I'm going to take this with me everywhere I go hopefully many times um, in the next few months um, so I didn't really want it to have too many things sticking off of it that's going to get banged and bumped so what I did is I just um, sticky taped um, this paper down and then I mod podged it, um, made sure it was on there very, very good. And I kept flexing it um, because I noticed every time I moved it, the paper shifted. So I made sure that I, I flexed the paper as it was drying by just opening and closing the flaps um, a lot and just um, that's pretty much all I did. And then um, I didn't like how open these sides were. These sides were just black. So I picked out a couple of flowers and, and put them aside and just really wasn't happy with it. So I grabbed some ribbon and I went through a bunch of ribbon and I came up with gluing, hot gluing this one. I glued it all the way around each side. And then um, I took off this knob and I cut out one of the blue, one of the fairies, and I um, put glossy accents all over it to keep it down. And then I went to work. And then when I came, when I was at work, I got the idea of um, because it still didn't look finished in the front of putting these little black flat back pearls on. And then I wasn't sure how to use this tie. I had this ribbon in here, but it wasn't flexible enough. So I ended up using this type of rim, but I'm not so sure that's going to stay. It's actually pulling down on that button quite good, or that knob or whatever. But anyways, um, so we'll see how long that lasts. And then, now you're going to know why I, what I'm using this for. Anyway, anyways, I glued it all down, and then I glued black, the flat black pearls on here as well. And then I'm using it for my sunglasses. Pretty neat, huh? So, they're just knockoffs or whatever. They're Liz Claiborne's. I got them for $9 at the Superstore. So, the Real Canadian Superstore. It's like a grocery store, Walmart. I don't know if you guys have them in the States or not. Um, but I got... But they're really big. So, I don't have a sunglass case for it. So, that's what I made this box into. A little sunglass case. Oh, um, I forgot to mention that inside this case um, I lined it with um, that um, craft foam for kids. Can you see that? So it's nice and soft in there for the glasses. And so hopefully people like it. Anyways, I also did um, a wedding card that uh, for a friend of mine, but you'll have to go to my blog and see that. And I actually was pretty impressed with it, so that's good. Um, not wowed or anything because you don't really like your own work a lot of times, right? Um, but other people were impressed, so that's good. So anyways, I did this um, just last night and part after work today. So it only took maybe, um, I would say maybe two hours total to do this. And I'll probably have to change this black thing. I might actually, I don't know if there's a chance to use a magnet or something. Oh, I don't want to use a magnet because of my cards. Anyways, I'll try and figure something out. But that can't be good. Alright, thanks for watching and nice to see everybody. Bye.